This is what you can do today to improve your ride tomorrow. DressageTrainingOnline.com, providing video training tools and resources for riders of all levels across the globe. From the position of shoulder in, we start a pirouette at the walk. We try to maintain the same rhythm and straight. Inside the walk pirouette, it's important to bend, and it's the beginning of a shoulder in, collection, weight, and small, and bend, small. At the end, what we're trying to get is to imprint the rhythm that we want inside the exercise, and that we're going to control as we control the different parts of the horse. That's why it's important that at the beginning the horse is manageable both to the left and to the right, and on the inside leg and on the outside leg, so that we can position the horse wherever we want by changing the bend at the moment we want, such that in a more difficult exercise we can resolve it. Good. Since we're already at the walk, we can do another exercise to improve the pirouette at the canter. That would consist in, and truly it's very easy, well, easy, there's nothing easy here, but perhaps this is an exercise that's easy to understand, and with a little bit of practice, if we're in a walk pirouette, with the control in the pirouette at the walk, we're looking for to bring the, the legs in, the feet in, so that he's attentive to us. Super focused, good. It's important that with the minimum reaction of your leg, that the horse responds. Not too much, just to make sure he's paying attention to you. Inside the walk pirouette, we can come back to the exercise. When we have control of the pirouette at the walk, we're going to ask inside the pirouette to canter and asking the horse to maintain that he stays within the pirouette from walk to canter. Canter and bend, 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 bend. Super. Relax. And walk. 